Hey, what's up? David Alex here for Ideas to Creations. Quick tip. And in this one, I'm going to be showing you something interesting you can do while grading. Now, create your adjustment layer at the top of your project once you're done, of course. And you want to use, say, curves and uh, an effect like color balance. Now, usually when you work with these two, you're kind of tweaking to your eye and you can't really see what your histogram is doing. Now, a nice and easy way to do that is to add a levels effect right below everything. So I'm gonna put this right down there and you'll see that I get that graph. Now, if I come back up to my curves and start to tweak it, you'll see that my levels updates immediately. Like as I'm dragging, I can see the changes in the levels. So I can change this to show only the grayscale graph and then I can come in here and maybe reset my curves, tweak these points and see what effects it has on my histogram. Pretty handy. And then I can switch over again and play around with these and see what effect it has on my different colors in terms of their levels in the histogram. This was David Alex with a quick tip on use color grading. You can follow me at I2C blog on Twitter where I just tweet all these tips as they come. And uh, you can also subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Um, this is David Alex and I will see you in the next one.